Hey everybody, how's it going? Jamie Wagner here again. Hey, thanks a lot for watching my video here, guys. So what I have here for you is the Google Nexus 7 2013 second generation tablet. This is the 32 gig model and it's currently running Android 4.3. So in one of my previous videos, I showed you guys how to perform a hard reset using the settings menu in here under backup and reset, which we'll go in real quick here and take a look. So go under, go under your all apps section here. Go to settings, scroll down through your menu here until you get under personal and you get to backup and reset. So we went in here under backup and reset and we chose to do a factory data reset here, which erases all data on the tablet. Over here we had these nice boxes here. We could check mark these, which allowed us to backup data and automatically restore apps and their settings and data. So alternatively, if you guys cannot access that screen, and you still need to hard reset this tablet, there is another method for it, and I'm gonna show you right now. Before we start, just so you know, you need to make sure you back up all your pictures and all your music. Um, if you guys understand that uh, all your stuff is synced to your Google account, that's fine, because you will have the options to restore. After you get to the welcome screen, you'll, you'll have the options to restore and bring that stuff back to your tablet. But as a secondary precaution, you know, um, make sure that you guys are backing up your pictures and music before you do this because this is going to perform a complete wipeout again of the tablet. So the first thing you want to do here is basically power your tablet off. So press and hold the power button. Um, if you can't get this dialog to come up and your tablet's in such bad shape that you can't do anything with it um, in this screen, you, you know, the screen's on and you're pressing the power button and, and that screen's not coming up. Just, I think if you continue to hold down your power button, the tablet will eventually, it should power off entirely. So if you can't get to this dialog, just keep holding your power button down until the tablet shuts off. But, but what you want to do is get the tablet to power off. So once you guys get the tablet to power off, here's where we're going to start the process. What you want to do is take your finger here, press and hold the power button down. I'm not going to do it just yet, but find the power button. Come over here to your volume um, key, and you want to find the volume down. Okay. So what you want to do is press and hold power button. As soon as you see the Google logo pop up, press and hold the down key on the volume key. So I'm pressing them both at the same time until I get in here to the system bootloader. So what this is going to do is get me in here, as you can see, into the system bootloader. And what this is going to allow us to do is enter the, the Android recovery mode. Okay, so what you guys want to do is these arrows here are your, your volume up and volume down key and this big arrow here points to the power button. So basically, if you press your volume up, you're gonna see it go through the menu here of some different options. Like it'll, you know, start shows up. Um, this one says power off. This one says recovery mode. This one says restart bootloader. And it goes back to start. So just, you know, press the volume up key um, until you get to recovery mode, okay? I just wanted to show you how the menu worked there and I just wanted to scroll through it once to show you. So you want to be in recovery mode and then what you want to do is press the power button one time. So after you press the power button, you're going to get the Google logo here. And then what you're going to get is an Android guy with that red triangle with an explanation in it and it is going to say no command. So at this point, what you want to do again is find your power button over here. This time you want to find the volume key up. Okay, so using the power button, you press and hold down power and just press one time the volume key up. Press it and release both and that will get you in to the Android system recovery mode. Okay, which is basically this screen here. So again, you can use your volume up and down keys here to scroll through that menu. Okay, 
So what you want to do is you can see the first one at the top there says this top says reboot system now you know the second one says apply update from ADB which we're not doing that stuff the one you want is wipe data slash factory reset so just make sure you're highlighted on top of that uh, wipe data factory reset and go ahead what you want to do from here is press your power button okay and under this screen you want to scroll down using your volume keys again just scroll down to where it says yes delete all user data now what you want to do here again is press your power power key and there you're going to see the little android guy he's doing his thing erasing at the bottom you're going to see it's wiping data and formatting data and it should come up formatting cache and like i said this is doing another um, hard reset and it's formatting the tablet and you know essentially what this is going to do is bring you back to that welcome screen that i had in one of my previous videos after doing a hard reset so there it says data wipe complete you can see he's back on his back there and it says no command so up here all you have to do now is just basically press the power button because the one that's highlighted is reboot system now so the one that's highlighted there is reboot system now and all you gotta do is press the power button and what that's going to do is reboot this tablet to the google logo then we're going to go to the nexus logo then what's going to happen after this is it's going to take us to the welcome screen now i did find one more thing i could show you guys um, when this device is powered off of how to avoid going actually into the bootloader but it takes you into takes you directly into the Android recovery mode. I think it kind of goes around the bootloader, so I'll show you that here at the end as soon as we get to the welcome screen. Pretty easy to do once you get the hang of it. You guys will be able to go in there and do it like nothing once you learn how to simultaneously like push the keys over here and in the right order, uh, you'll be able to go through this like no big deal. So there you go, there's the welcome screen, just like in one of my previous videos after doing a hard reset using the other settings, right back to the welcome screen. So now what you want to do here is power off this thing. Power the tablet back off. Normally, you guys would just continue there and go through the welcome screen, but I have something additionally here I want to show you. So what I'm going to do is show you something additionally here. And what you want to do is press, for, for this one, press and hold the power down. When you see the Google logo, press up on the volume key and hold. So you're pressing and holding both. So you're pressing the, the power button right now and you're pressing and holding the volume key up and pressing and holding the power button down. See, that as soon as you see this little guy pop up, Android there, just take your fingers off. And as you can see, it gets us back into the um, Android guy here, flat on his back, no command. So what you can do from here is simply so press and hold the power button and just touch power up, our volume up. And that takes us right back into that screen. So it's almost like a shortcut around the bootloader. So that's pretty cool. Um, and again, that's the basically the same screen there that we're in to do the wipe data factory reset. It's actually almost seems to be a step um, faster. So you can try that method too. But other than that, I'm going to select Reboot System now and press the power button. I just want to reboot this thing and get me back to my welcome screen. So I can go ahead and start restoring my tablet. 
really we probably don't have to sit through sit through that but i do want to let you know this before i go um once you get here to the welcome screen and you start going through the process of re you know resetting your tablet here hope i'm hoping that at this point your tablet's working and you start restoring your tablet you're going to come to some options in the uh in the settings here you know during this setup process that's going to allow you to check mark the boxes to restore apps and things like that so make sure you go through and check mark all those boxes um, other than that guys that's pretty much it thank you guys very much for watching the video i hope this helps you know you guys out if you're having some some big issues with your tablet hope it gets you up and running smooth again um, i hope you guys subscribe to my channel and like my video thanks a lot and you guys have a good one